Welcome to Friday's Chef's Culinary Corner, and we're gonna show you what's in the lunch pail, but first, I gotta show off my new lunch box. Isn't this awesome? You got Han on there, you got Chewy on there, and by the way, this movie rocks. Let's check it on out. I wanted something old school and vintage. All right, we got some water. That looks like blueberries and grapes. I got some pickles and the star, dun da da da, chicken of the sea. Here we go, Sando edition. I got some avocado, mayonnaise, and mustard. Yum. Okay, so this right here is really interesting, and we're gonna talk a little bit about it. Some of the ladies will bring me food from their country to try out, and this one is from Cuba. So we got some ham, some noodles, and some pineapple. She called this one uh, salada fria, so cold salad, right? Mmm, it's got a summery kind of taste to it. I love the way the pineapple brings in a different kind of flair. Reminds me of something else. So once I was brought this Colombian dish, she called it perro caliente, so essentially hot dog, right? But here's the kicker. It's a hot dog. They used pineapple marmalade and topped it with shredded fried potatoes. I mean, delicious. You don't think that that would play, but it plays. It was so good, guys. Made sure to bring some pickles today so I could do it a real sandwich style. I love changing it up with these. It's just, they're so versatile. They're so delicious. I mean, we got protein in here. You got omegas and a little more omega-3 with some avocados from Mexico. Oh, now this is a sando you could take to the office. Happy Friday. Cheers, me hearties. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Pickles really enhance so much about it. Fun fact about pickles. America would have never been discovered without pickles. That's right. Christopher Columbus felt so strongly about having pickles on deck his ship because it protected against scurvy that they had to stop and I believe it was Haiti at some point so they could plant cucumbers before they continued their voyage so they could make pickles. He refused to travel without them. One more fun pickle fact for you. George Washington, the first president, remember him? Pickle connoisseur, loved them, had over 200 and some odd variations of pickle. Yes, indeed. 